Welcome to my Essential Poetry Readings. Today I'm presenting you one of the most astonishing and most tragic poems of Federico García Lorca, a lament for Ignacio Sánchez Mejías. He, its first part, Cogida and Death, La Cogida y la Muerte. We all know that Federico García Lorca belongs to the generation of 27, a group of Spanish artists who met for the first time in Seville in 1927 to commemorate the poet, the laureate poet, Luis de Gongora. And Ignacio Sánchez Mejía was a poet and intellectual supporter of the generation of 27 group and was a great friend of the poet García Lorca. Passionate about Andalusian folklore, he became a bullfighter. Retired as soon as his youth passed, he resumed at 42 as a choice of death. He will in fact be killed by the bull during his last bullfight in Manzanares Arena in 1935. Lament for Ignacio Sancho Mejías or Llanto for Ignacio Sancho Mejías is a eulogy that the great poet wrote for his friend the bullfighter in the same year of his death. Cogida and Death is its first part, and we can all read here that it is punctuated by the obsessive refrain a la cinco de la tarde or at five in the afternoon, which was the alternative title with which the poem is known and with which I am reading it below. At five in the afternoon. At five in the afternoon, it was exactly five in the afternoon. A boy brought the white sheet at five in the afternoon. A frail of lime ready prepared at five in the afternoon. The rest was death and death alone at five in the afternoon. The wind carried away the cotton wool at five in the afternoon and the oxide scattered crystal and nickel at five in the afternoon. Now the dove and the leopard wrestle at five in the afternoon and the tie with the desolated horn at five in the afternoon. The bus string struck up at the five in the afternoon and there's scenic bells and smoke at the five in the afternoon. Groups of silence in the corners at five in the afternoon. And the bull alone with a high heart at five in the afternoon. When the sweat of snow was coming at the five in the afternoon, when the bull ring was covered with iodine at the five in the afternoon. Death laid eggs in the wound at five in the afternoon. At five in the afternoon, at five o'clock in the afternoon. A coffin on wheels is his bed at five in the afternoon. Bones and flutes resound in his ears at five in the afternoon. Now the bull was blowing through his forehead at five in the afternoon. The room was iridescent with agony at five in the afternoon. In the distance, the gangrene now comes at five in the afternoon. Horn of the lily through jean and green groins at five in the afternoon. The wounds were burning like suns at five in the afternoon. And the crowd broke the windows at five in the afternoon. At five in the afternoon. Ah, that fatal five in the afternoon. It was five by all the clocks, people, and it was five in the shade of the afternoon.